one. <laughs> Fuzzy bear. <laughs> Thank you. At, Doug? We are at the portage into Brunswick Lake from the Missinabi River. So what? Right, which is very historic. <clears throat> it's been here for a long time and hundreds and hundreds of people have traveled this over the last hundreds and hundreds of years. Are you pretty excited I'm about it? I'm very excited about it. What makes you so excited about it? Um, I like to just be in the space that uh, people were hundreds of years ago and I like the history of the area. I think it's really interesting. Very excited to get into the lake. Nice. Yeah. 1500 meter portage? Yeah. Is it? No. Yeah. One mile. Yeah. One mile. Wow. Are you in miles? Okay, well, <coughs> I'm in both. Because you do things in millimeters. Yeah. For building. That's right. These are some, one of the older portages on the route. And just, Checking out some old blazes on these trees. It's pretty neat to think about all the fur traders that traveled this route before us and <laughs> they leave smiley faces on big. I'm sure that that is what the other uh, trappers and traders would do for each other along the trails. I'm that's certainly what they would do. Yeah, Pete, you might want to leave your toboggan. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's heavy.
Okay. Okay. You hang on. Yeah, you hang on. Excellent. It has valuable stuff on it. Excellent. I'm just gonna go this way. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoops. <laughs> Cleared the big trees. That was the most important. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay here for a while. Can you hand? Was it as fun as you were expecting? <laughs> Already got nine and a half K, including the portage. Today, day nine. And we're just entering the southeast bay of Brunswick Lake. We still want to put in another six K. Which might be ambitious, but we're gonna give her a go. See what travel conditions are like on the lake, but I assume it's gonna be fairly wind packed. Hoping. Because it is windy, so hopefully that wind has done something good. Is this a secret O. Henry eating mission? <laughs> I was wondering what the plan was. Well, the plan... It's been a pretty good day today already. We've done 12 and a half K, um, including a big kilometer and a half portage. Um, we're thinking we knock out another 3K this afternoon. Be about an hour at uh, current uh, conditions, current pace. So... Yeah, it'll be a big day, 15 and a half. Um, we're here on Brunswick Lake and we've been pretty keen to explore the lake a little bit. So figure knock out a big day today and then we can do a half day tomorrow, take us near the end of the lake and then uh, spend a bit of time around um, yeah, an old HBC post and just kind of maybe do some fishing, try to pull up some, uh, some fish. And yeah, big day today and an easier one tomorrow. I'm more rocking it. It's doing great. It's been a cold day too, though. Mm. <laughs> Can't probably see it, but there's an otter that just popped up out of a hole in the lake. Dave's pointing at it. Oh, there's his tail. He just went back down. Good eye, Adam. <laughs> He's still, his head is still there. <laughs> it's such a, yeah, such a small hole. change of scenery. Come on little buddy. <laughs> this one's a bigger hole. How? Where can my stick keep those open? 
No kidding. How cool is that? Found it. <laughs> Bring her home. Nice work. Pull on right in. Thank you. 30 more meters. You can do it. Oh, the valet parking put me in the deep stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I accept sour keys and those watermelon things. GB today? Hey, yeah. Oh, Crushed it. GB for group best. Uh, group best. <laughs> I'm <laughs> pretty full. <laughs> Excess of energy right now. <laughs> today, everybody, how was today? 15 and a half K. That's how it was. GB. It's great, it's mm. cold. Personal best. Windy. Yeah, awesome. Yep. Yeah, the Dave was sacking a bit, but you know. <laughs> yeah. The octopus just through. The dev march from who? Yeah, the octopus just through. Yeah. You hungry, Dave? Getting there. <laughs> Getting there. The machine. Beyond hungry. Beyond pain is a new land. Does anyone want dessert? Yeah. yeah. Go with this fruit. Fruit cake. Day 10 morning. We're leaving our camp. We've got the light snow again. Doug says hi. You can see the smoke from our campsite and the sun rising. Very beautiful. Everyone's ready for a knock em out easy day, 10K. Already have some blue sky in the making. Seems like every day we get a little bit of light snow in the morning. And once the sun hits, kind of breaks everything up. Clears it up into a nice sunny, but often windy day. So more mild this morning, minus 21 compared to yesterday's 31. So I think we're gonna do a lot better today. Whose toboggan have you got? Becky. What's wrong with Becky? She's got a bad day. Oh. <laughs> so we short one. There must, must be a spare one, hang Did on. Did you not get one? Yep, but Mike hasn't got one. Oh, right. I took uh, everyone oh, out of the bag. <coughs> ah, is that it? Yeah. That's it. Oh, looks like a good one. Thank you, guys. Let me know when you want bread. This stuff. Yeah. I'm going to have it now. Oh, you get it out? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, check it out. Hello, TM, baby. <laughs> Who's up? <laughs> all right, all right. All right. <laughs> yeah? Okay, God, you the rest. Peanut butter Rollo. Yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. It was Adam. He called yeah, it. Go on. Got to give it to him. Well, don't you like those? No, I thought it was going to be another Snickers. <laughs> Hold on, I might trade you. I'll trade you. <laughs> Sorry.
Mmm. Oh. Leslie Crunch. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you did yeah, it. You know what? You said it. Yeah. I would trade that, dude. Delicious, really. Yeah, fucking good. Waiting for one of these. Mmm. Hershey Special Dark. Oh, this is yummy. Mmm. Kit Kat Matcha. Oh, you tricky. <laughs> you tricky. Suspense is good, but there's a danger the last ones might be melted. <laughs> They're so long. Hazelnut Snickers. Yes. Oh, oh, good one, dude. Yes. Jerseys, jerseys. No hazies. No hazies. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Oh. I'm very warm and happy. Snickers? Yes. Trey? Thanks. Wakes up, snags the Snickers. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, Thanks for the bargain, man. We are at the top end of New Brunswick Lake and at the old site of the HBC fort in the 1700s. And it's a fitting variable weather day with these really cool gusts of sort of like snow natos and it has a very magical feel to it. You can just picture people coming here for the first time and European settlers coming across, the Aboriginal people Working the land to get by and to settle in the new world. And obviously, there is wrongdoings, brutality, but with the land surrounding us right now, so beautiful, it's hard to not think about the hope and dreams of people who walked before us and ah, just looking at the land here. There's a little map of the site. They had a big garden and yeah, just in this vast wild country. A uh, part of our history that we should remember, and what a way to do it by walking by snowshoe to it and beyond along this historical route, the Snobby River.
Come on up. Parking lots up here. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> What's up? Hey, hey, this is what's up. 37 below. Feeling it, loving it. Ready to kick some uh, kick some miles out. Whew. <laughs> Minus 37. Pack down. <laughs>